lungs what's something that you do all day every day no matter where you are or who you're with breathing air is necessary for keeping humans alive what are the two parts that are large and in charge when it comes to breathing if you've guessed your lungs you're right our lungs make up one of the largest organs in our body and they work with our respiratory system to allow us to take in fresh air and get rid of stale air and even talk let's take a tour of the lungs we have to breathe all the time in order to supply our bodies with oxygen and get rid of carbon dioxide we use our lungs to do this air from our mouth and nose enter the windpipe which go down the throat into the chest then it splits into two passages one for each lung oxygen helps our cells get their energy from food they would die within minutes if you stopped breathing trees help clean the air by filtering out pollution they also make oxygen which they release through their leaves breathing heavily gives your body extra oxygen so it can work harder you feel puffed out and pant when your lungs can't supply your body with oxygen quickly enough people can spend a few moments underwater without breathing most people can manage about a minute but the world record is about 17 minutes have you noticed that when you breathe onto a window or a mirror it becomes wet That's because the air that you breathe out is slightly damp. Exercise is good for every part of your body, especially for your lungs and heart. Your lungs are full of tunnels ending in tiny air sacs called alveoli. Here, oxygen from the air passes into your blood. Your blood carries oxygen around every part of your body. Believe it or not, you take about 23,000 breaths each day. It has three important jobs. 1. to store the food you've eaten. 2. to break down the food into a liquidy mixture. And 3. to slowly empty that liquidy mixture into the small intestine.